I think losing a pet is still just like losing a human family member because this pet has been part of your life, uh, part of your family. Um, they love you unconditionally. You can have a horrible day and there they still are. They get us through those tough times in life and they are family. It doesn't matter whether they're furry or feathered, um, they are part of our family and, and it hurts. It hurts to lose a loved one that's been so close to you and, and been so loyal and, and just part of a special memory of your family. I have an older dog now, and so I know I know what's coming. I know our routine will change. I know um, the history and all the things that are coming up. So I, I know what it's like to, to sit on both sides of the table. The way we care for pets at end of life is very similar to, to humans. So we do have cremation options available for pets, and that wasn't something that was available years ago. We do have burial options for pets. I think the fact that we are a mobile society and we're moving around more, I think that's definitely changed. Um, the cremation rates are on the rise, and I think that's affected. People want to take their loved one with them because we're a mobile society. We are able to care for families who come to us directly, and then we can also care for families through their vet clinic as well. Most pets pass away at a vet clinic, and so we're going to then be able to care for the families. So we're continuing to help with our veterinary clinics as well as those families that come to us directly. We're seeing a definite increase of, the, of a mobile vet. Um, there's a benefit, they don't have the brick and mortar, so they're able to be flexible, they're able to come to someone's home, and they're able to um, care for that pet right there at the very end. I, I think it's a wonderful service. I think when you're, when you're in those challenging situations, to have somebody come to your home and take away that extra one added bit of stress, I think is really nice. As a mobile veterinarian, I provide veterinary services for end-of-life care for pets and their families in the home. I come to them where everybody is most relaxed, including the pet. In my experience and from the feedback I've received from my clients, the wonderful uh, dignity and respect that every pet is treated with by the team at Best Friends and also the care and compassion that the families are treated with by the staff members at Best Friends are really what set them apart. Best Friends might surprise you, we care for a lot of different types of pets. Um, we have cared for snakes and guinea pigs and hedgehogs and birds and dogs and cats, alpacas. Uh, even small horses, so um, we know people have a lot of different best friends and so we we're going to be there to take care of that best friend for you when the time comes. We've got numerous urns that you can select from, we can do a paw print, we could gather a small clipping of fur, we can do some beautiful memory glass. So equally important, I think, is to memorialize. Sometimes memorializing is just by engraving your pet's name on the urn. Best friends can help you with that. Reach out to us because when the time comes, we want to be there to walk alongside you and to help you with whatever your situation might be.